So hold up, you're telling me that there's no speed limit? No speed limit. Well, look at it. You got no the pedal to the floor right race. now. Let's race Ryan. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You're sure that there's nothing in front of us when we're gonna be I'm racing? Positive. Here. Hey! Oh, those cheaters. One, two, three. Oh! Oh, we're gonna see you guys later. <laughs> Drainage ditch. Oh my God. <laughs> I was very caught off guard. It was like the road just ended, and now we're we're at the Salt Lake Flats. Just like we're back home. Ken, this looks nothing like back. Home. <laughs> what? What about this looks like back home to you, Ken? The lakes, the frozen. Do you not go ice fishing? You went ice fishing one time. You cannot say that. Holy crap! Wow, this feels so weird. This is like grip tape. Salty. Dude, Utah just continues to blow me away. It really does. How's the sandpaper? If I move anywhere in the world, it's gonna be Utah. It's so grippy. That's right. what Hold we up. were just saying. Hold up. Make sure it's salt. Yeah, I gotta taste it, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I can't just <laughs> We're at the Bonneville Salt Flats. So basically, from my understanding, there's no speed limit. Come on! There's no speed limit out here, no rules. They set like all the land records here. And from my understanding, the DNR aren't gonna come out here and give you a ticket for doing donuts. Can you imagine if our buddy Jacob just showed up? Honestly, I'd be pretty happy. I'd get another good thumbnail and title out of it. He comes in on just a chopper, just, <laughs> jeez! Over. We brought the shifter cards. We're gonna rip those around. And then on top of that, obviously we were in Utah, so we had to hit up our buddy Chandler from Godfrey Crew. I don't know if anyone else has ever done this, but this is the first I've ever seen it. A lowered drift razor. That was an 85 mile an hour 360. Yeah, I believe on that last one, you guys slid like sideways for way longer than any of the other times. Hey, I'm so excited. Hey, I want you to remember the value of this thing. 70 grand. Please don't mess this up. I mean, I'm not gonna try. Four wheel 
wheel drive. Okay, wait, wait. Explain the cycle. I don't even know what Okay, is. so basically, you put in four wheel drive, you crank it all the way to oh, left or right. Are you saying it just rips? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And didn't... then and okay. then just floor it and then just trust the process. Okay, it it's... should do it. You almost like flipped. Yeah. yeah, but the center of gravity in the in the Mav is way taller. <laughs> yeah, you don't like this is gonna just it's all gonna. Right, all right. Yeah. Build a that drift razor and then tire. build some salt flats. Dude, our Maverick would have been flipped over like 16 times by now. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's a good thing we didn't bring it. Why are we so illy repaired every time? Every time. One of the shifter carts has a flat tire, so Ryan just ran to the gas station, try to air it up. We are leaking this beautiful 110 all over the damn place. There's no good way about this. Dude, we are so underprepared for every single thing we do, which makes, oh, whoa, oh, oh, jeez, man. I ask this trucker, I'm like, can I use your air pump? And he goes, no, 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 I'm not a mechanic. And I go, no, I just need the air. And he's like, oh, okay, they, they fix it for you. I was like, no, they don't have air. Like, I just need that. So I bring the card over and I'm like, okay, fill it up. And he goes, I do it, I do it. And I'm like, okay. Puts it to the tire and instantly it's full because yeah. it's like a freaking semi compressor. Yeah. And then it just goes, Psss. and I'm like, stop, stop, you're good, you're good. Would not listen to me. I literally had grabbed the thing and pulled it off because the tire was going to explode. He goes, you no touch me, you no touch me. What? Flips out on me. And I'm like, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Just like grab the cart and throw it in the trailer and just peel out. What? It was the most wild experience. Only Ryan, dude. Only Ryan. Oh. It's already flat. Really it's already good. flat. All right, let's just run it. That thing's seen better days, huh? Our, our uh, shifter cart? Yeah, dude, that thing's falling apart. Yeah. Oh, what? It has seen better days, but those days were so long ago, they almost don't exist. Probably never Seriously, again. Dude. This one's going flat. Push on that again. You're right on the rim. <laughs> I was wondering why this car was so slow. I was like, man, I'm waxing this thing. Waxing me. I just thought we really mixed the ratio lean this time. I was like, this thing's fast. <laughs> Beating me by the way. Oh, was I? I wasn't sure if you Dude, were trying. I was tapped out. What? I was at 85 and you were still had something to go. <laughs> Shit, maybe we did mix the ratio extra lean today. Because it was not happy at the end. I might have blown up. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. Oh, oh. 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 This That's is part of his track, dude. The high facts melted and stuck. Yeah, that's not supposed to come off. Yikes. 
Come on, Ken. Get the whole thing. Jesus, Ken. <laughs> Not <in> here. <laughs> this is weird. It's like. Oh, Throw it all in. So is this just pure salt? Man, Ken, you, you look like you got a whole grain on your <laughs> tongue that time. <laughs> <laughs> now we need to come back with like some fast cars. I would love to come back, yeah. that's for sure. We just gotta like, you know, get the money to afford some fast cars and then then we'll be back here. <laughs> Alright, so we're back home. We filmed another video while we we're in Utah, but there's a couple other YouTubers there. We all agreed to post it next Monday. So we're holding off on that. Be ready for it. It's absolutely insane. It's probably one of the most insane things wild. I've ever witnessed. But for the time being, Enjoy the rest of the video. Ken freaking sold my can with his sled. Okay. The stock can. Buyer of my sled wants the stock can. Oh, like, you know, normal people always put their can away, their stock can. They don't just steal their friends. Is it in the other shipping container? I mean, as long as you find your can, I don't really care. It's just like... We'll find it somewhere. Yeah, I mean, the guy only comes in, uh... Uh, one hour. Was this a prank or? No, it's not a prank. <laughs> <laughs> it's <is> not funny. <laughs> okay, so last week, if you guys saw the video, we got a little too zapped and we destroyed, I think like 20 plastic chairs. We? Yeah. What do you mean? You. The f I didn't. No, I didn't. It was mostly you, Ben. You were definitely the instigator. What? All night you were like, let's smash some tables. I'm gonna hop on my three wheel. I was like, no, no, no. And then yeah, I leave. Anyway, and you anyway, drive your three wheel. That's beside the fact. All right. Anyway, so they're they're not our chairs, and we're basically in debt to Ryan's dad. Like, he claims 150 chairs. Hey, we've smashed a lot of chairs over the years, though. Let's just say we've destroyed 150 allegedly. There's this place called Alibaba. It's basically Chinese Amazon, where we can go on and order plastic chairs in bulk size, and I think we can order. 320 of them for $4.48. 320 times 484? 1,800, yeah, pretty good deal. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of a steal. Yeah, oh Chair. shit, we own four tables too. <laughs> so anyway, that's where we're at right now. Thought we would keep you guys updated. We might have a little party when we get these chairs in though. I'm, I'm kind of excited. We're never gonna be able to have money, Ben, if we keep breaking everything <laughs> and then having to replace it. I wonder if we can do custom, like put C-Boys like stamped That'd into them. That'd be pretty them. sick actually. Like, I don't want custom, I just <laughs> want white plastic chairs. They're all branded with our stuff on them. <laughs> Give it a couple reps. I don't think it's supposed to do that. Yeah, I was gonna say, since when did it start popping like That's that? That's the first time I've ever heard that. And it doesn't matter, you're gonna switch it out anyways. You can just disregard that. I know you guys love my Raptor. It's the best truck ever made. A lot of you guys say, well, the best motor ever put in. Right, the V6. A, a truck, the V6, best fuel economy. All in all, just a real truck. Yeah, all in all, just a real truck. So to add to it, I finally got an exhaust. So I hit up the company, AWE, and uh, I'm not gonna lie to my surprise, they were stoked to work with me. So they sent me this exhaust, finally just got it in, and we're gonna throw it on today. Should do wonders for this thing, because it needs it. Needs a lot of stuff. It needs a lot, but we're gonna start with the exhaust. <laughs> okay. Also, we're working in this bay today because this bay is under construction. Our shop renovation is still in the process, but we're definitely gonna let you guys know when that's done because we're gonna be super pumped to show you. Hey, I'm not a typical rapper. Nah, I don't got chains, I don't got blame. That's not the shit that I'm after. It's not, yeah. Look, I'm not a typical rapper. No, I'm not Taking the page out the book, I'm a different chapter. Hey. All right, we're getting impatient, so. Let's hope this exhaust sounds good because it's never going back to stock. Look, hey, I'm not a typical rapper. Nah. What is this saying? Measure once, cut twice? <laughs> what y'all expect me to look like? Huh? Shook Knight? Uh, look, I don't want to fight. Man, we should have just done that from the beginning. Yeah, it was definitely the easier route. Alright, bro. Yo, that Ben, anymore. you should start your truck with it. No muffler, just right here. Dude, who would even buy exhaust? You just take your muffler out. What are you doing? What? Man, just
just like that, that smart car is completely trashed. I'm going to uh, pick up a new dirt bike and I have a deal for you. When I get back, I'll let you ride it if you let me hear your exhaust. No. See you boys. Bye boy. Tell your friends that watch that, that I say hi. All okay? right. All right boys, without further ado. Ah. Oh, that's right. All right, without further ado, hey, probably cover up your ears. Last time I did that. Exhaust sounds great, but it's making a new noise. Yeah, yeah, I noticed that. I didn't want to say anything. Mother trucker, Ryan, dude, that's so touching. hot. You I know, but it's that, it's that far away. I didn't think it was that hot. How's it sound? It sounds amazing, dude. I'm bringing the juice. If you don't know me by now, let me just be you do. I am a baller, but I am a devil like I'm the dude. Well, uh, big thanks to AWE for coming through for the V6. It needs all the help it can get. So we'll link them down in the description. If you guys want to get an exhaust for your car or your Raptor, I would highly recommend AWE. Thanks, guys. I'm bringing the juice. If you don't know me by now, let me just reintroduce. Dude, I think I just got a pretty f***ing sick shot. <laughs> Way to go, Ken. Okay, so I'm driving the shifter <laughs> cart, and I took a video of me driving it, and I... <laughs> I couldn't put my ball in my pocket so I put it in my pants. I took a picture of my balls. <laughs> I was looking, I was like, what is this? And I'm like, oh. Oh. Holy crap, Ryan. That is Dude, almost, that's some real dummies on shit right there. I almost can't delete them, you know. <laughs> They're so good, I might just send them to my girlfriend. <laughs> Get some, she's just looking at it. Like, what what, what is, is this? this? No dick, just balls. <laughs> <laughs>